Hey guys, I'm Kristen from Miss Chris, and today I'm obsessed with geometric shapes. Today we are going to whip our room into shape. We are going to make pillows, we are going to make a rug, and we are going to do a wallpaper stencil that is going to be to die for. So today we are going to transform a boring pillowcase into this fabulously triangular pillowcase. For this project, you will need a blank pillowcase, you will need a sponge, a pair of scissors, and some paint. Because we are doing triangles, we are just going to cut out a triangular shape in our sponge. Now that we've cut our sponge into our triangle, we are just going to take our white paint. Fabric paint is always great to use. Since we want a spongy effect, we'll use this side and we're just going to dip it in the white paint. Now I personally like to take and do like one or two just on my plate here, just to sort of make sure that I get like the big gloppy excess off. And then we're just gonna go straight to our pillowcase. Look at that. And then once you think it's getting a little empty there on your sponge, you go back and you just like refuel with more paint. But I kind of like this. I love the sponge look. I love that not every shape is the same. All my triangles were going that way. So when I come back up on this next row, I'm going to alternate and have them facing up. And you will just finish this process all the way across your pillowcase until you're done. Now, wallpaper can be very expensive. If you are living in a place where you can paint, why not create your own? For this project, you will need a sponge brush, wall paint, and a whole lot of artistic freedom. Now, I'm obsessed with black and white. I'm also obsessed with polka dots, so that is what we're gonna do on this nice, clean, white wall. And there you have my fabulous wall. I'm so excited about that. To see how I revamped this juke rug, head over to my Makeful article at bemakeful.com. I'm Kristen. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. And if you'd like to follow us on social media, there are links in the description bar below. Now, if you are wondering what I will obsess over next week, you'll just have to come back for more. Come on.